Hey, this is Russell again, and we welcome you to the third video in the List Hacking series. Now, this video is one I'm really excited for because it's going to kind of blend uh, what we talked about in our last video with direct mail, with junk mail, and uh, and with what we're doing online through this list hacking process. Now, if you remember, we talked about yesterday uh, with junk mail. Um, the process that people are using offline is really, really cool, and I still love it. Uh, we actually are doing it now in a couple of our businesses, and it's kind of fun to to do. But the process, the way it typically works, is you've got some kind of product or service you're selling, right? And so so right here, here is the, the product or service that I'm selling. Now one of the keys, and it took me a while before I got this, and most people when I first start explaining this to them, they miss it, and I want to make sure you don't miss this piece. But this is how it works, okay? Offline, typically it's going to start with some type of ad. Right? It could be a, a magazine ad, it could, be, uh, it could be a classified ad, it could be even a radio ad, some kind of ad though. And typically that ad is trying to get you to respond to something and in return they're going to give you something in exchange. Right? For example, you might see an ad that says, hey, for a free report, a free report about uh, how to make more money, you know, call this phone number or send us a self-addressed stamped envelope for this thing. Right? But there, the ad is, is promising and offering a free report typically. Okay? This is how it works offline. And so they go and, and you respond. You go and you respond for that free report, and when that free report shows up to you in the mail, guess what it is? Okay, that free report is the actual sales letter, the sales message. Okay, now this is one of the, this is the concept I want to drill through to you guys. The free thing you're offering on in your ad is the sales message. Okay, the offline guys get this, but whenever I take it online, people get really confused. They say, "Okay, Russell, I have my squeeze page, and I need to write a report, and I got to write a sales video and a sales letter, all these things." But no, no, that's not the answer. The answer is again, we got to look back at the offline guys. Their ad is offering a free report, and then the report that shows up in the mail is the sales letter. Okay, I hope you guys got that because that is a, a, a big secret here. All right, so if you look here, uh, the uh, the way we do it online, it, it it runs very similar. Okay, we still have a product to sell. Again, it could be your own, it could be somebody else's, it doesn't really matter, but you've got a product that you're going to sell. Okay? You come back now and you have your ad, and your ad online is typically going to offer one of two things, either a free report, okay, and you use a free report if you're going to be uh, selling them through a sales letter, or a free video if you're going to be selling them through a video. Okay? Now this free video is going to show them something or teach them something. Okay? There's got to be some kind of value tied to it, otherwise people are going to be like, wow, I just, you know, I just opted in for a sales message. And so you have to have some kind of value in there. But they're going to opt in through the ad and then typically we take them to a page right here where there's going to be a video. Okay? Now sometimes in, in a typical online marketing, you go directly from your squeeze page, uh, excuse me, you go from ad to a squeeze page, left out a step here, and then from the squeeze page over here. To your sales video, okay, um, and or your sales letter, whatever that thing is, and that's kind of the process we go here um, online. Okay, again, it's very similar to the offline world, but it's but it's happening different. So the, the first big key I want you guys to understand is that when you you were sending somebody to a squeeze page, the free report, the free sales letter, the free thing you're giving them is the sales message that's happening on the next step. Okay, all right. So this is how we do it online. All right. Now it's pretty simple, pretty easy. Um, and so where people get stuck is to create this whole funnel. There's a lot of steps, right? You got to create a product um, and a service. And usually from this product, you're going to have upsells and other things you're selling them. And so there's this whole piece here you've got to create. It takes a lot of time, a lot of energy. And then you come back and you got to create an ad, and then a squeeze page, and you know, and then your sales page. And sometimes we have this page here in the middle we call a bridge page. And there's all these different pieces. And so it's really, really difficult typically. And so what I want to show you guys is what we call list hacking, where you can take that process and really simplify how it all works. Okay? All right, so this is how list hacking works. The first step is you've got to find some kind of product or service to sell. Now what I recommend for most of you guys, especially if you're just getting started, is don't go and create your own product first because there are so many pieces involved with that. You got to create the product, write the sales letter, um, design the pay, all these things that right now I don't want you focusing on. I want you guys getting success as quick as possible. So because of that, I want to take out all these variables that are going to keep you from having uh, success. So I want you to find another product to sell, another service to sell, either as an affiliate, uh, if you're involved in a network marketing or home-based business, find something else that you're going to be able to sell because I don't want you focusing and thinking about that part right now. This is list hacking. Our goal is to build a list very, very quickly. And so the product at the end doesn't matter as much. Uh, the goal with that is to help us break even our ad costs, but our real goal is to build a list. And we'll talk about that here in a minute. Okay? So again, first we find the product. Now what we typically do is most of these products are going to already have some kind of sales video or sales message to sell it. Okay? The person who created the product is already going to have that. So let's just say they have a sales video. 
okay? So I'm gonna look at that video, and what I gotta figure out, I'm gonna watch that video and find out what's the one golden nugget I learned from watching that video? What's the cool thing, what's the secret? Okay, maybe it's in the weight loss market and there's some kind of uh, way to, to, uh, to lose weight while eating carbs, or if it's in the make money market, how to make money without using Facebook, or whatever, whatever that hook is, right? So I watch that video and I find that hook, and I'm gonna pull the hook, that hook out, and I'm gonna come back here now to my squeeze page, and I'm gonna, on my squeeze page, offer a free video that, and typically the headline I use, it works just awesome, is free video reveals the number one secret to blank, fill in the blank, okay? So I'm gonna find that secret over on the video, and I say free video reveals the number one secret to blank, to how to lose weight without eating carbs, or uh, how to make money without using Facebook, whoever that, that secret is, right? And I put that on the squeeze page. Okay? Now again, as a list hacker, I'm not gonna go and create a whole sales video and all that kind of thing. Somebody else did that for me. So I have my squeeze page, right? Now, what list hackers do is after somebody opts in, we don't send them immediately to the sales message because if we do that, then the person loses the interaction with me as, as, uh, as the list owner. I need that person to build a relationship with me, otherwise they're not gonna buy from me in the future. So what we do is we create a little page here in the middle that I call a bridge page. And this bridge page is where you get to introduce yourself and then push them over to the product or service that you're selling, okay? So we build this little bridge page, and usually this video is really simple and just says, hey, my name's Russell, thank you so much for coming and, and opting in for the free video. It's gonna show you the number one secret here. Uh, in one second, I'm gonna give you the link to that video, but first I wanted to let you know that you know, I'm gonna be sending you emails, we're gonna be communicating, I'm gonna show you all the cool things that I find, and, uh, and I kinda just build this little relationship with them really quick. And then underneath there I say, now down below there's a button, if you click on that, it's gonna take you to this video that's gonna show you the number one secret to Again, fill in the blank. So I have that link under this, this video below here, and then from there they go and they watch the sales video and they buy this person's product, okay? And so this right here, you guys, this little piece, this is what list hackers like you and me, we do. We go and we find these products or services we like in a market we wanna build a list in, and then we build this little two-step list hacking funnel where we drive people in, they give us their email address, the next page we have a bridge page, we build this relationship with them, and then we send them off to go buy the product or service we recommend it, okay? And that is what list hacking is, all right, you guys? Now, the reason why this is so important um, it really comes down to the power of a list, and I've talked about this before, but I want to, I want to really ingrain this into your guys' mind, okay? When you go out there and start building a list, and you set this kind of funnel up, um, again, your goal is to be able to come back here and you spend a dollar in traffic, and you're gonna drive it into this funnel, and after they go through this whole process, out the back end, your goal then is to make two dollars out the back. I put a dollar in, I get a dollar back. You know, every time I start teaching this list hacking process, people always come back to me and say, well, Russell, that's awesome, but you know, what's my budget gonna be um, in this, uh, to be able to grow my list? You know, what's my advertising budget? How much money do I need to set aside to make this work? And I, and I always come back to say, look, you're not, you're not paying enough attention, okay? Um, if I was to go and give you a dollar, and you gave me two dollars back, what's my budget? How many dollars should I give you? Okay, the answer is I should give you every dollar I have. I should give you a billion dollars a day if I can because if I give you a dollar, I get two dollars back. I'm gonna do that all day long. Okay, and that's how this works in this process. If you can build your list hacking funnel in a way where I give you a dollar and I get two dollars back, I don't have an advertising budget. I wanna put as much money in as I can, as fast as I can, because I know that two or three days later, double my money's gonna be coming back, okay? That's the power of this whole online marketing thing that we keep talking about, you guys. You put a dollar in, you get two dollars back out. And so that's our goal with this list hacking funnel is to build that, but the cool thing is that the buy byproduct of that, okay, put a dollar in, get two dollars back out. The byproduct, what's exciting is that out the bottom of this little list hacking funnel, every time somebody comes in, they give you their email address, they go through this process and they either buy or they don't, that person now is added to your list, okay? So boom, this person is now added to your list. Next person comes through, boom, they're added to your list. Next person comes through, they're added to your list. And eventually this list keeps getting bigger and bigger and bigger. Okay, so why would you want a big list? That's kind of the next logical question. You know, what's the value uh, in a list? And I want to tell you that the list, and I'm sure you guys have heard this before. If not, I want to I want to drill it into your mind. The list is the most important, the only thing that matters in your in your online business. Okay, and I was lucky. I had a mentor when I first got started. His name is Mark Joyner. He drilled in my head over and over and over again. Russell, you got to build a list. You got to build a list. And so from day one, that was my focus. And at first, it was hard. 
Okay, it took a while to get somebody to come in. It took, it was growing really, really slowly. I remember it took me a month or two to get this thing up and running. And, and uh, after about the first month, I remember I was driving some ads in there. I got about 200 people. Actually, I remember the number because uh, I had a little, this little uh, sheet. I was keeping track of everything. In my first month, I had uh, 217 people join my email list. And I was like, okay, 217 people. What does that mean? Like, that's not a real thing. And so I started monitoring like how much money that would make me. And sure enough, that first month with 217 people, I made about $200. And I was like, okay, that's kind of cool. The next month I started growing, I got to the point where it was about 500 people. And that month I made close to $500. Then I started growing, I got to 1,000 people and I made about $1,000. And then 5,000 people, 5,000. It kept growing and growing um, to the point now where my email list is over half a million people large. And uh, what's cool is, I've, is as we've grown our list, that metric, it, it pretty much has stayed a constant. For every person that joins our list, we're averaging about a dollar per month per name on our email list. And so for me, I know that that's a, a metric I can kind of bank on. And for me, it made me really really passionate and excited about growing my list. I need this thing as big as I can because I know that every person on the list, that's how much money I'm going to be making. And um, I really think that when you guys understand that process, you're going to realize, man, first off, I need, to, I need to become a list hacker. I need to get into this list hacking process and focus on building a list. And if I can do that in a way where I spend a dollar in ads and I make two dollars back out, then I can, I can literally build my list for free or at a profit. Now sometimes you build this thing out, you put a dollar in and you only make a dollar back out. You break even. Okay, sometimes I even put a dollar in and I lose a little bit of money. Now you may think, oh Russell, that's a horrible business. You're, you're losing money on your advertising. But even if I lose money, you guys, I'm adding people to my list. And that asset is what you're trying to build online. That is really the key here. And so that's the list hacking process, you guys. That's what we're going to be focusing on. And so in a, in a couple days now, I'm going, to, I'm going to reveal to you guys a way where you can actually get started in the list hacking uh, uh, community and our membership site. And inside list hacking, the cool thing we do is that um, I talked about I want to take away all the barriers for your success. I want you guys to be successful as possible. That's why we said don't start with your own product because there's so many pieces. Uh, and with list hacking, same way, I don't even want you to start with this piece right here. Uh, in fact, for all of our list hacking members, we give them this list hacking funnel. We give it to them where they can set it up there, throw their opt-in opt -in box in there, and boom, uh, they've already got the list hacking funnel in place. We then show them the exact same traffic sources that we're buying ads on, and uh, basically you can just replicate our success over and over and over again. And it's a really cool thing, but literally, um, it, it'll give you guys the ability to come in here and try something and have that taste of success. What I found is when people have that taste of success once, they get addicted to it and they want it over and over and over again. I still remember the day that I made my very first sale online. Um, I was sitting in my college, uh, my college computer lab working and I'd been trying all sorts of stuff and I found this product, I really liked the software product and I tried like 20 different ways to sell it and somebody bought it. My affiliate commission was $20 in my PayPal account. I remember being so excited, I actually uh, called my wife, uh, I, just, I was newlywed, uh, and uh, told her at night, we're going out to dinner and a movie because I made 20 bucks online. And, uh, and literally, though, that $20 was uh, you know, probably the hardest $20 I made in my life. You know, it took two years of trial and effort and all sorts of issues before I made that. But man, it made it so much, so much more sweet when we actually uh, made that. And it's going to be the same for you guys. And so I want to give you that, that taste of success as quick as possible. And we're going to do that here through this list hacking process. And so uh, look for another video from me in a couple days where we're going to show you exactly how to become a list hacker, how to join the list hacking community. And then eventually, and like I said, at that point, you have all the funnels, all the things you need to be able to start growing your list. And, uh, and if you keep in the back of your mind a dollar per person, per month and just focus on that metric and focus on building your list, you guys. I promise you that in a month from now, you'll start seeing some results. In three months from now, it'll get better. In six months from now, a year from now, who knows how big your list can be. We've had people who joined this program who now it's been 12 months since they got started and they were skeptical and they were nervous and 12 months later, some of them have a list of over 10,000 people and making $10,000 a month. And uh, it, it's exciting, and that's why that's why we do what we do. And so, uh, again, in a couple days, I'm going to show you guys another video where you have a chance to join the list hacking community. Come with me. We're going to take you on a journey to help build your list. It's going to be a ton of fun, and then you can use that list to to uh, to basically do whatever you want. Uh, so it's going to be a lot of fun. So anyway, that's it for today, you guys. I appreciate you watching this video. Please leave your comments down below. Let me know what you think. Um, let me know any ahas that you had, any uh, any cool ideas. I'd love to hear them. And uh, I will talk to you guys again uh, in the next video. Thanks everybody, and we'll talk to you soon.